Well, hi to everyone who are watching this presentation. We are Federico Curacuria, Chino Rubin, and Nicolas Rios. And we are three electromechanical engineer students for, from UTN FRP. And well, first of all, we will talk about, or first of all, in this presentation, we will talk about uh, the aim of our presentation. And then we will describe the context or we will describe the, the area in which uh, the main problem is developed. And after, after that, we will uh, explain uh, all the things that uh, are in relation with the problem and uh, how we want to approach it. And for the last, we will talk about or we will discuss the strengths and weaknesses uh, of our proposal. And well, it is well known that water is a resource that is used in every home around all of the world, basically to satisfy our, our needs as humans. But sadly, in La Santiaguena neighborhood uh, uh, and the people uh, who live in, in this, this place, suffer daily many uh, problems in relation with uh, water scarcity. And because of this situation, uh, the aim of our presentation is to deal with the water supply problem in La Santiago neighborhood, basically by uh, increasing the pressure in the, in the pipeline with uh, water pumps in each home. The first step we have to do is study and describe the context. La Santiago neighborhood is a medium class neighborhood which is located a few streets uh, ago to the Costanera. It is surrounded by San Luis Street, San Lorenzo Street, Surubia Street, and Nagoya Street. The next one, please. This neighborhood counts with uh, wide sidewalks and around 20 houses per street. Only uh, have one building with six floor and 14 apartments. Okay, and now uh, we will state uh, the problem. Um, the water stress in the Santiago neighborhood has been an annoying problem uh, for the people who have been living there for a long time. Uh, also, there are many other problems in the area uh, that arise from the, this main problem. And they are affecting almost every home there. Next one. Okay. Um, and now we will make a description of scene that help picture the problematic situation. In this picture, we can see um, one common situation in La Santiagueña neighborhood. This pipe has been broken for a long time. One. In this other picture, it can be observed another annoying situation in the neighborhood. This situation is related to water gushing onto the street or the sidewalks and due to the broken pipes. This scenario it becomes worse when it rains because the water from the rain and from the broken pipes make the street completely flow. One of the main causes that give rise to this problem is the bad quality to, of the water. This water is collected from the Parana River and is delivered to a water treatment plant. This treatment is bad, so the water have a bad quality and uh, corrodes the pipes. Also, the network uh, distribution is old, so the, this uh, promotes the breakdowns 
of these old pipes. The next one, please. Another main cause is the water low pressure. This increases the desire, the, the hydration in people and animals. And uh, the people can refresh them in summer because uh, they can't uh, take showers and fill in their, their pools. Yeah. And now we will talk about the problem consequences. And <clears throat> well, it's obvious that the water scarcity is a problem that uh, raise many other problems. Uh, for example, uh, the lack of water does not allow the people to cook some uh, kind of food and make them uh, buy or spend money in uh, fast food. And also the lack of water uh, does not ensure the a good hygiene and sanitation and hydration. I mean. And another consequence is that uh, the people cannot refresh themselves because uh, this 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 same consequence because they cannot uh, fill their pools and they cannot take a quick shower at least. And one of the most important consequence is that uh, there is frequently low quality water running through the pipeline uh, because of the improvised solutions which are temporary and uh, this uh, solution are short-term solution uh, which means that the, the the main problem or the consequences will continue and another thing that we want to say is that uh, all this situation all the situation not only produce uh, physical issues in the people who drink the, the low quality water, but also generate a lot of stress in, in these people who suffer uh, many of these problems uh, day by day. After having analyzed the cause and consequence, um, the water shortage has for La Santiago neighborhood. We believe that the implementation of water pumps uh, in each home is a possible solution uh, to this problem. These pumps can be used to easily fill the water tanks, which are normally located on the roof the, of the house. At a height of five to 10 meters approximately. To archive this, a 0 0.5 horsepower pump can be used, which pumps 30 liters per minute. And it can pump water with a good pressure at uh, a um, maximum pay uh, of 25 meters. Also, it is a monophasic pump, so any neighbor can be used. Um, and this pump has two years of warranty. If the if this device is used with uh, clean water, um, the performance will be the best possible. This pump is very quiet, so the neighbor may not complain about disturbing noise. Um, in relation with to the pump specification. Um, the pump axis is constructed with cast iron and the pump has a bronze impeller which improves the durability. 
this type of pumps provide more amount of water flow compared with uh, the centrifugal pumps. Uh, and in relation to the electric specification, um, it has a electrical overload, overload protection to increase the reliability of the device. This solution has some strength and advantage. The first one is the speed of repair. This pump can be repaired in a short time uh, place. The second one is the availability of spare part. This spare part can be bought in every uh, hardware store. The third one is the quality price relationship. And the fourth one and last one is the adaptability. This means that the pump can be uh, installed in every situation and every home, home and place. Also, this uh, solution has a few weaknesses and disadvantages. The first one is that uh, the pump is not viable in high buildings because uh, all the pumps have a, an height limit to provide the water. And uh, the other weakness are the high codes to install the, the pump. The conclusion. We believe that the most urgent problem that the Santiago neighborhood faces is the low water pressure. Obviously, um, that there are other problems uh, that are consequence of this main problem, but it's important, it's important to solve this issue first because the people need to carry out uh, their daily activities. And also, uh, we think that the implementation uh, of uh, water pumps to achieve this objective is the most feasible solution because the, the, more, the most amount of, of effort that is needed is only economy. And uh, the neighbors only have to pay or buy the construction materials and pay the, the workforce salary. And also we thought that uh, maybe the store uh, can do uh, uh, a discount for uh, buying because of the neighbor uh, may buy uh, many, many devices at one time. And also uh, we thought, we think that uh, this solution is medium or large term solution and uh, compare with the, the 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 pay that has to be or the purchase that has to be done and also in terms of time and efficiency is the the best way to, to solve this this problem and well thank you for your for your time and your attention